An aqueous solution of barium hydroxide is standardized by titration with 0.250 molar solution of hydrochloric acid. If 9.25 ml of base are required to neutralize 15 ml of the acid, what is the molarity of the barium hydroxide solution? So the first thing you need to do in order to answer this question is to write the balanced equation for the acid-base reaction. So the reaction is between barium hydroxide and hydrochloric acid. So barium hydroxide is a dibasic base, which means it requires two moles of the acid to react with it. So we have barium hydroxide plus 2HCl forming barium chloride plus 2H2O. The problem says you have 15 ml of the acid. So 15 ml of the acid solution you need to convert this first into liters. So we know that 1,000 ml is equivalent to 1 liters. So ml of HCl would cancel. Now we have liters of HCl. Then we are given the molarity of the HCl solution, which is 0 0.250 molar. So that means for every 1 liter of the HCl solution, it contains 0 0.250 moles of HCl. So the liters of HCl solution would cancel. And we have moles of HCl. And then we need to convert moles of HCl into moles of barium hydroxide. So how do we do that? We look at the balanced equation. So according to the balanced equation, one mole of barium hydroxide requires two moles of HCl. So we plug that into our equation. 2 moles of HCl, 1 mole of barium hydroxide. So the moles of HCl will cancel and our unit would be moles of barium hydroxide. And if you compute this entire equation, this is equal to 0.00. .00 875 moles of barium hydroxide. The problem is asking for the molarity of the barium hydroxide solution. So how do we compute for molarity? We know that the formula for molarity is equal to moles of solute divided by liters of solution. So we already computed for the moles of barium hydroxide previously. It is equal to 0 0.001875 moles divided by the liters of solution. What is the volume of the barium hydroxide solution in the problem? According to the problem, it's 9.25 ml. So 9.25 ml, convert this to liters. We know that 1,000 ml is equal to 1 liter. So lit ml would cancel and our units would be moles per liter. And if you solve formularity, this is equal to 0 0.203 moles per liter 
or 0.203 molar because moles per liter and molar are just the same thing. So this is our final answer.